Deep in the vastness of space, there's a spacecraft that's been exploring for over 40 years. That spacecraft is the Voyager spacecraft, and it has sent back some mind-blowing discoveries over the years. It has survived harsh conditions and ventured further into space than any other human-made object. But what is Voyager's most shocking discovery? And what are these final images that it has sent back? One of Voyager's greatest missions was to deliver the voice of 8 billion people outside the solar system, hoping to connect with other intelligent life. How did it survive space for so long? And what secrets has it uncovered? In this video, you're gonna see the extraordinary images and discoveries made by the Voyager spacecrafts and learn about the incredible journey they have taken. Stick around until the end of the video to learn what secrets of the universe Voyager unlocked and what new questions it raises. If you are new to this channel and this video gives you any value at all, please click the like and subscribe button because that would really help us out to go ahead and pump out new videos for you guys. The Voyager Interstellar mission is actually divided into two spacecraft, Voyager 1 and its twin sister, Voyager 2. Both of these historical spacecraft were designed to accomplish the same mission, the same goal, to discover everything that humans do not know inside and outside the solar system. Even with them sharing one common goal, these spacecraft explored a seriously different path, allowing us to uncover a lot of uncharted territory in the universe and unravel its shocking mysteries. One of the first and most incredible images that the Voyager sent us was way back in 1981, when the Voyager 2 spacecraft made its approach to Saturn and gave our astronomers extremely valuable information about the ringed planet. Actually, Voyager 2 was overtaken by Voyager 1 when it reached the planet in 1980. Just a year later, in 1981, Voyager 2 took its turn observing the planet, especially its most distinct feature, the astonishing Saturn rings. Voyager 2 exceeded expectations, as it gave NASA its first great look at the ever-mysterious Saturn, providing crucial information like the detailed structure of Saturn's ring. Voyager discovered shocking truths about Saturn's rings that we never expected before, like their true composition. The famous rings of Saturn are composed of countless individual particles, billions of them, ranging in size from tiny grains of dust to gigantic boulders. It also revealed that Saturn's rings are incredibly thin. The rings themselves are only a few kilometers thick, despite spanning hundreds of thousands of kilometers in diameter. There are also observed gaps in between the rings, with the largest one extending 3,000 miles or 4,800 kilometers. They coined it the Cassini Division, because Saturn's moon, Cassini, has a direct gravitational influence that makes the gap even wider. Voyager 2 captured stunning images of Saturn and continued its journey, this time to the second farthest planet in the solar system, Uranus. A planet we knew little about when Voyager 2 arrived in 1986. Thanks to the spacecraft, we are closer to understanding this ice giant than ever before. At 50,600 miles, or 81,800 kilometers above Uranus's cloud tops, never before seen images of Uranus were captured. One of Uranus's most striking features is its distinctive blue-green color. As Voyager sailed past Uranus, it discovered that Uranus's atmosphere contains small amounts of methane, which give the planet its color. There are also traces of other gases, such as ammonia and hydrogen sulfide. Just like Saturn, Voyager also took a closer look at Uranus's faint rings. Voyager 2 discovered that Uranus has a total of 13 rings, which are composed of dark particles also ranging in size from dust to boulders. These rings are relatively narrow and confined to a small region around the planet. Uranus is a bizarre planet. Aside from its distinct color and tiny rings, Uranus is the only planet with a very strange orientation. Voyager 2 found out that Uranus is tilted almost 98 degrees which means that its rotational axis is nearly parallel to the plane of its orbit around the Sun. Voyager's discoveries about Uranus do not end there, as it unraveled 10 new moons orbiting the planet, bringing the total number of known moons to 27. The largest moon, Miranda, has a highly varied surface with features ranging from canyons to large fault scarps. Voyager 2's mission does not end here. As it continued traveling, the spacecraft got farther and farther away from our planet, with a new goal of observing the solar system from the outside. The spacecraft reach interstellar space. When the spacecraft was launched in 1977, the thought of having to travel into interstellar space was a little bit far-fetched. Although theoretically, the spacecraft could indeed go into interstellar space, many scientists were not convinced that it could last that long. But in 2011, 
Almost three decades after the Voyager was launched, all doubts were erased as Voyager 1 became the first ever spacecraft to reach interstellar space. Voyager 2 followed seven years later in 2018. Crossing uncharted territories, their journey to the outer reaches of our solar system was far from easy. Now, they were sending data from regions we've only just begun to explore, including the mysterious and protective heliosphere. Get ready to uncover the secrets behind these uncharted territories as we delve into the exciting discoveries made by these brave explorers. Prepare to be amazed as we explore the depths of the heliosphere, a vast bubble-like region of space that surrounds our sun, stretching far beyond the orbit of Pluto. Acting as a shield, it protects our precious planet and other celestial bodies from the harmful effects of cosmic radiation and particles from beyond our solar system. But what lies beyond this protective barrier? The heliopause marks the boundary where the solar wind meets the interstellar medium, causing it to slow down and merge with the surrounding gas and dust. Only two spacecraft, Voyager 1 and Voyager 2, have ever ventured this far from home. As these brave explorers linger in the depths of space, they continue to send back data that leave our scientists stunned. And now, brace yourself for the chilling final image that Voyager sent back from beyond the heliopause. Are you curious about what the Voyager missions have found in our solar system since 1977? They have taken over 100,000 images of various objects, including planets Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune, and their work is monumental. But out of all those pictures, Voyager just sent the final one to our scientists, and it's not some distant planet or object, it's a picture of us. From 3.7 billion miles, or 6 billion kilometers away, the Voyager captured a single grain of sand floating in nothingness. The pale blue dot. That's us, right there! Astronomer Carl Sagan requested this photo to give us a unique perspective on our place in the universe and the fragility of our planet. And with Earth taking up only 0.12 pixels, this tiny, insignificant speck of light is a testament to the Voyager's remarkable achievements. Both you and me are in that tenth of a pixel, which shows how incredibly small we are, taking into account the scale of the universe. The pale blue dot is a powerful and iconic representation of our place in the universe, a tiny, fragile, and insignificant speck of light in the vastness of space. Scientists and even avid space followers were inspired with a sense of wonder and awe reminding us of the importance of protecting our planet. But this photo isn't just a pretty picture. We can analyze the brightness and color of Earth's light to determine atmospheric gases such as nitrogen, oxygen, and carbon dioxide. It's a reminder of how important and useful capturing photographs can be. The pale blue dot image is an enduring symbol of the power of science and exploration. 